The first thing the Democratic governor did was face facts, at least in his view. Shapiro fully believes Joe Biden and Donald Trump will survive the primary season. He expects both to be on the ballot in November. Shapiro also acknowledged the polls here in Pennsylvania. They have Biden and Trump neck and neck with Trump leading in some. Well, the race is closed, but understand the campaign hasn't really even joined yet. And this is the reason why we run races. And I would say to folks who are worried about the numbers, stop worrying and start working. ABC News called Governor Shapiro one of Biden's biggest allies. Shapiro did not dispute that, thanking Biden for his help on Pennsylvania projects, like fixing a damaged Interstate 95 bridge in Philadelphia in only 12 days last year. Donald Trump took Pennsylvania in 2016. He lost it by a razor-thin margin four years later. Shapiro predicted another Biden win here in November. Every other time Pennsylvanians have had the opportunity to go to the ballot, they have voted for freedom and against extremism. They rejected Donald Trump in 2020. They voted for me by an historic margin in 2022. In spite of Governor Shapiro's prediction, just about every political expert calls Pennsylvania a battleground state in 2024, a state that can flip either way. 19 electoral votes are at stake, one of the larger prizes in the country. Andy Palumbo, Newswatch 16.